While unbounded priority inversion and the need for priority inheritance might sound very esoteric, this actually causes problems in the real world. A classic example is the Mars Pathfinder incident. The Mars Pathfinder was a rover that launched July 4th, 1997, and was sent to Mars. It was notable that it had been decades since the U.S. had gotten onto the surface of Mars, so this is a big deal that this rover landed and started running around. But there was a problem. After the lander took some great pictures, and you can see the rover there up against a rock, they had rover failures. Multiple system resets occurred via the VxWorks operating system. Now the good news is the watchdog timer was set properly and it saved the day and it reset the system to a safe state. The bad news is that because of the time delay with Mars and the way the mission was run, every time you get a system reset, you would lose hours and hours of mission time. You only get so many days on Mars due to the dust buildup on the solar cell, so every time the system reset, this was a huge problem. It lost a significant chunk of the mission. The team was eventually able to reproduce the problem on the ground. They uploaded a patch, and then the mission was successful after that. But the root cause for those resets was, in fact, pretty much exactly what we saw on the preceding slide. It was unbounded to priority inversion due to a medium priority task delaying things, causing the watchdog timer to trip. How did that happen? Well, the developers did not turn on priority inheritance. The operating system had it, but they turned it off because they were worried about processor performance and execution speed. The explanation was the data bus task executes very frequently and is time critical, so we shouldn't spend the extra time in it to perform priority inheritance. But skipping that step almost cost them the mission. The moral of the story is you have to turn on priority inheritance if you have mutexes that can result in unbounded priority inversion. And if it's too expensive, you need to rethink your system and re-architect your system so you don't need the mutex anymore.